back to my channel today i'll be taking you guys along with me to show you guys how i take care of my hair my skin and pamper myself it's been i guess it's been so long since i've last took proper care of my body it's getting hotter by the day here in guwahati and so i'm finding it really hard to stay fresh and, but i feel like this self-care of pamper would really help me to feel that so first for me my hair is really important and without my hair looking good i don't feel good i don't look good so taking care of my hair is really important for me especially nowadays because i've colored it bleached it and really damaged my hair so before washing my hair i oil my i massage my hair with oil like i wash my hair twice a week i guess but nowadays it's so hot i I'm finding it really hard not to wash my hair but washing your hair every day damages your hair a lot and it dries out all the natural oils so I'm gonna first massage my hair with coconut oil. Now that I'm done with massaging my hair I'll keep it for maybe 15 minutes let my hair roots let my roots soak in the good oil time's up and now i'm gonna hop into shower and show you guys my daily shower routine i'm using my wooden brush to detangle my hair moving on with the shampoo i use this matrix optic care shampoo and i've been using it for over a year and it really helps me smoothen my hair for hair mask, I recently switched to L'Oreal Professional Hair Mask and I'm not kidding you guys, I really like it. It smoothens my hair instantly. Palm Olive Body Wash smells amazing, but on daily basis I use papaya soap. This couldn't have come at a better time because I recently ran out of my face wash and look what I got, Jovis Herbal's Tea Tree Face Wash. Having an acne prone skin is really a struggle as it makes my skin really sensitive but this face wash has all the important ingredients from tea tree to lemon extract to neem extract. One thing I love about this product is that it has foam consistency which is very good for oily skin. If you want to get your hands on this, it is available at their official website Amazon Nika at a very affordable price. I shave my facial hair maybe once or twice a month. It takes that unevenness from my face and is a great way to have a good base for your daily makeup. I don't usually put on sheet masks because I have a very oily skin and most of them tends to be very oily. But to give myself that feeling of pamper and love, I wanted to do this. One thing I feel about sheet mask is that most of the serum goes to waste so I like to apply it wherever my skin feels dry and it's that extra love. Moving on, here I'm doing the usual skincare that I follow, but I have to give it to Cosrx. I recently switched most of my products to Cosrx because it does wonder. Having sensitive skin, it is really hard to find your true match, and I think I finally found mine in Cosrx. Here you can see my acne scars pretty clearly. I wanted to make a separate video about my skincare journey, but what better way than to add it in my self-care vlog. 
So I had a pretty bad experience with acne. First it started when I hit puberty. So I thought it was just hormonal. But then one year later, it started again and worse than the first time. But it went away and again after one year it came back but this time it was worse. It took all my confidence and so I thought it is high time to see a good dermatologist. And this time the doctor told me I might have problems in my ovary. He pointed it out right there and told me to visit a gynae. Long story short, I found out I had ovarian cyst and that is making me break out so much. So I took medications of cyst side by side. I was having chemical peeling procedure with my derma and after 2-3 months everything cleared up. So if you are struggling with severe acne, please check it out with good dermatologists. It's time to dry my hair. Since I recently made my hair suffer a lot, all for the beauty, I stopped using much heat on my hair. So letting my hair naturally dry is best. I'm using this serum from Tresemme. I don't know if it works wonder, but it smells amazing. And when I go out to help my hair prevent from any frizziness, I use this product. I don't know how to pronounce their name, so here it is. I'm going to finish off my physical self-care. I'm going to use this moisture. It smells so good. I really like the There's no lip product that works better for me than this thing. It heals my lips automatically. I have very I have very dry lips because I think I don't drink enough water and when I'm dehydrated my lips crack easily and wrestling comes in handy with that. I usually don't apply any makeup after so much skincare but I had an ad to shoot so I want to add some more on my acne journey. I've used tons of products for my acne which I regret but I had to learn it the hard way. But I'll tell you what I learned. Cetaphil has been my only staple product since day one for 7 years. Sunscreen is very very important. Do not pop your pimples or else you'll have deep scars just like me. Even though I don't have any major problems now, but I do break out every now and then. And I know why. It's because I can't cut out dairy, I eat cheese on every daily basis and that is very very bad for skin. And one more thing, I am not advising any of you to go for chemical peeling. It is a very concentrated procedure, so consult with your derma before anything. So my advice would be proper diet, good sleep and first knowing why your skin is reacting this way rather than focusing solely on the products. I would be lying if I say dancing is not a form of self care for me. I've always been a stage girl. I love music and dancing. Freeze of my body. I just hit 1k in YouTube. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Thank you so much. It's all because of you guys. Oh my god, I'm super, super, super happy. Thank you so, so, so much. I still can't believe 1000 people subscribe to my channel thank you so much